I wanted to be a pilot ever since I can remember. Uh, when I was a young child, I wanted to be a pilot. Uh, got my first chance to fly, uh, actually hands on the aircraft when I was 13. I was a member of the Civil Air Patrol and I got a chance to actually pilot the aircraft a few orientation flights. I actually started as an Air Force navigator. I spent 11 years flying KC-135 refueling tankers. At some point, right towards the end of my 20-year uh, career, the unmanned aircraft system opportunity presented itself. The job I have now is flying a Global Hawk uh, unmanned aircraft. It's a high altitude jet aircraft. It flies over 60,000 feet, but we actually pilot it from a ground station using satellite links. Uh, so we can virtually fly the aircraft anywhere in the world from our ground station here at Armstrong. We have another one back east at Wallops Island, and we also have a portable ground station that we can deploy anywhere we want and fly the aircraft. Most recently, just returned from Wallops Island where we were doing hurricane research. And on this recent mission, uh, we uh, dispense what's called a drop sonde, which is a small radio transmitter about the size of an empty paper towel roll. Uh, it, ha it measures wind speed, temperature, humidity as it falls. It's suspended on a little parachute as it falls through the hurricane. Our aircraft carries 88 of those. So we are able to drop one of those every five minutes over the storm and measure this. That data is then being downloaded to our ground station and being fed directly into the weather models, improving the weather models as we're flying the aircraft. It's, it's truly amazing stuff, almost, almost real-time corrections to their models, giving them the uh, better ability to predict hurricanes and understand what, what turns a storm into a hurricane. Well, I was fortunate, at least in regard to the unmanned aircraft, I've been flying those for about 15 years now, so I was able to bring experience to NASA. That learning comes from just getting out there and doing it. It comes from making mistakes. It comes from trying new things. It's, it's, it's all important. I would tell anybody that was uh, considering a career, have a goal in mind, but also be open to opportunities and be ready to take those opportunities and take the risk. When the unmanned aircraft opportunity came along for me, there weren't a lot of guys that really wanted to do that. They thought it was a fluke, that it was never going to last. Uh, in my case, I couldn't have imagined a better opportunity for me. So I took the risk. I, I, I took the jump, the leap, whatever, and uh, boy, I've just been very fortunate since then.